2015 Christmas haul. Woo. So I did one of these last year and I thought, why not do it again? Because you seem to like it, I think. I hope. So, yeah. <laughs> so the first two things that I got are my faves. Lush bath bombs, hells yeah. And this one is Shoot for the Stars, which smells so nice. I don't actually know what scent it is, but it, it really does smell orgasmic. And um, the second one is Yognog, which sounds like, it, it sounds, what am I saying? <laughs> it smells like toffee. It's really weird, but really, really really satisfying so yes i love me some lush i does i love me some lush so yeah those are my first two presents my second present is the hollister skylar perfume and honestly like my guilty pleasure is hollister perfume because on it, it smells so good like so good and this one just it my next thing it's a soap and glory like huge gift box, would you say? It's really nice. I think my mum's hinting that I don't smell nice, so uh, great. So in this, it comes with fluffy socks, which I've worn. Um, one of those like fluffy things that you wash with in the shower. Do, do you get me? Probably not. Um, so the righteous butter, which is like body butter hand cream and heel genius which is really good it smells like kiwis and it goes underneath your foot and makes your foot like feel all nice and moist moist my next present is a hollister bag and it is really nice brown and it's got like a cute little cute little pattern on it and i love these sort of bags because they're really easy to take places um I had another one there, but as you can see, I got a pen on that, and honestly, like, it didn't look very attractive, so I got a new one, and I'm really grateful because, I, I, like I said, they're really easy to put your phone in, your charger in, and when you go to the cinema or to town, so great! My next present were, honestly, they were, oh, mm. They are makeup brushes and I've I've lived on about like a £10 pack of makeup brushes which have done me really well for the past eight months or something and these are a bit more expensive. I don't know how much but my mum said they were and honestly they're so soft and they're great and I love life right now and I hope to improve my makeup by using these, hopefully, maybe. <laughs> my mum also ordered the contour kit, um, the Boo Bell, or the Bow Bell. Don't know how to pronounce things, I'm sorry. My pronunciation, I can't even speak, okay? Just something like Bow Bell or something, yeah. It, um, it's a contour kit, but it hasn't come yet, which I'm really annoyed about, so. Fuck you, post, you, you bitch. My next present is from my dad's cousin, I think, I think. And it is a really, really nice um, nail polish set and it comes with like glitter. And I really like doing my nails. I don't do them often because it, get, it kind of gets like messy. And it also, it's just my school, don't really like it, but. I'm leaving school soon, so this will come in handy, so yes. My next present is off my grandma, let me just get it, and it's this really nice striped jumper, and it's it's knitted, I think, it's not, like, it's from New Look, but it's sort of knitwear, and it's just really flimsy, and it's really nice and cosy for the winter. Not that we're actually having cold weather at the moment, we're having warm weather. Where to go, talk about the weather in your video, great. <laughs> But yes, it will be nice if it ever does get cold. Ever. <laughs> My next gift, I think, is literally everyone's aesthetic at the moment. 
which is aliens and honestly this is so cool and it's just it's I just love it I don't even know how to describe it but I like to put it under like a jacket and it just looks it just looks good look at that look at that aesthetic right there my next gift is a bit of a joke, but it's it's absolutely on point and fantastic. It is this. Soul's down. But yeah, I just, I thought I'd cyber bully Dan Howell and just buy this, which is I think his most hated photo of himself. I'm loving the hair, so I'm just going to wear that wherever I go. So yes, great, fun, fab. My next gift is from the Dan and Phil shop and it is the black t-shirt with the llama pocket because who doesn't love living in 2011? Because I'm, I'm pretty sure I do. Banter us, to be honest. Lol llamas. My next gift is another thing from Hollister. Yeah, I know, I'm a slut for Hollister, to be honest. And it's just this really nice, aesthetic grey jumper with just the Hollister logo. And I think, I think Hollister has really upped its game lately. Like, in 2012, everyone would wear it, it was just over overrated. But literally, I just, I like it now. And they smell nice. They like really smell nice, so yes, woo, smelling great. I also got the outfit that I'm actually wearing now, which I will show you here. I'm such a naturally talented ballerina, wow, wow, great. And my last piece of clothing that I got is a purple t-shirt that says Howl91. I don't know, my mum just got it for me because she was searching my bubble and I think it's kind of cool and it's just, it's a really nice material as well so it's a bit of bounce to be honest. My next two presents were mugs and people that know me probably know that I have a complete and utter fetish for mugs. I know that sounds weird but I love them. Take a look at these two beauties. The Costa one is basically it has all the stuff to make your perfect latte and my mum has a coffee machine so I'm going to make lattes and put the little template thing on the top so I can have patterned like coffee beans with cocoa on top of my latte so great swag, cool, I like it. And the Tetley mug is really really cool I thought. Because honestly, like, it's, it's just so cool. It's just like a head. It's drinking out of a head. Yeah, that's all I really need to say about that. I also got something which I've been wanting for a while, which is a clapper board. I've always wanted to do that. It's so much fun. It's like... Can I make little tunes out of it? This is about as far as my musical skills go. But yeah, it looks really cool in back. It made a cheeky appearance. Later on, it's gonna make a cheeky appearance now. So there you go, clapperboard. You are part of my new background. So yes, fun. And my final present was something which you can probably see on the desk next to me. But most of you, or some of you may know that about five months ago, I completely trashed my phone. Accidentally, of course, but my mum stepped on my foot and I jumped with my phone in my hand and the, the phone went up and down it went onto the drive and it was never the same again. It kept crashing and it was just bits of glass were coming out of it and tiny minuscule bits of glass were also going in my like fingers and it really it just it really really hurt so it's just nice to have a new iPhone which I am literally I my baby and I've put a case on it this time well a more protective case than my other one and it's from Redbubble and it just has Dan and Phil from Reading Festival 2013 and I got the rose gold colour because the rose gold is like so nice and I literally, I just, this case is really hard to get out, to get the phone out. 
and I spent about 20 minutes getting it out to film this to show you the back properly but I did it and then I put the case back on the phone to discover that my camera had like crashed and hadn't filmed any of the footage so I was I was quite frankly distraught but yes it's it's a cool colour and it's a very very good phone and I hope my mother doesn't step on my foot again so yes great that was my Christmas which was very very good <laughs> I wish you all had a great Christmas and if you didn't just just remember things do get better and if you don't celebrate it but you live in a place where people do celebrate Christmas then I hope you enjoyed the holiday that you get for nothing so winter break for you if you enjoyed this video uh, give me a cheeky thumbs up and I'll put the link in the description to the one that I did last year where my hair was really frizzy I, it's probably worse now but yes there we go. It's been a great year over on here. Tell me down below what presents you got, what your favourites are, what your worst, worst presents were, <laughs> and whether anyone tricked you or pranked you, because like I love, I love the videos of people pranking people with presents. I'm so cruel. Um, but yeah, just comment all things gifts down there and I will be sure to read them and comment if if needs be so yes this is a, this is just a rambling mess see you soon <laughs> bye